On average, the black dollar circulates for about six hours in a black community. We need to do better as a community to support black owned businesses, but that's sometimes easier said than done. Before we can support black owned businesses, we need a readily available economic search engine to be able to find those black businesses to support in our communities. The Central Black Business app is the answer to that question. The EVA is always on the community side, meeting the community's needs with easy access. Hello everyone, it's me Demetria Kay of The Demetria Kay Show here on YouTube and a proud contributor of the African Diaspora News Channel. If you could please do me a favor and subscribe to all channels and like this video, I would greatly appreciate it. So just this past weekend, CEO of Tesla, Elon Musk, rolled out the Optimus Humanoid Robot AI at the annual AI Day in Northern California. Now that event is meant to attract different talent to the AI industry and specifically to that of Tesla. Now, during that AI day, they rolled out their robot, the Optimus Humanoid, and it walked around. It didn't really do much because they're still, you know, making it, if you will. Now, in 2021, they talked about a robot. It was the Bumble C. Uh, but it had somebody dancing around in, I guess, a costume dressed like a robot. But they came and they showed out this uh, particular year. Now, it's not the first time that Elon has talked about a robot. In 2015, he talked about making a robot. And so here it is in 2022, getting close to being a reality because they said they actually want to have it in mass production uh, sometime next year. Now, the robot has the brain that the Tesla car has and that the computer chip is the same. It also has about 11 functions that his hands can do and it can walk before it couldn't do that. They would show a replica at a workstation, but this time it showed up to walk. And so uh, they said that it could go to the grocery store for you. Uh, it obviously can take commands and do things around the house and things like that. It says that the battery will last the whole day of, you know, work and commands or whatever the case is. And so, I mean, I think great if you have $20,000 to pay for it. And if you ask me, I don't think $20,000 is a bad price tag for basically having another human or human that can do things for you. Now, it has also been said that the only thing AI cannot do at this moment is become aware. Now, aware basically means that it knows who it is and it has feelings and it can think for itself and things like that. So they said the minute they being uh, Stephen Hawking, Elon Musk and Bill Gates, they all had some intrepidation about AI. But they said that if it does become self-aware, we are in trouble. And you can think about that of the Terminator movies where the machines did become aware and they were trying to get rid of the humans. So they're saying those experts and a whole lot of other people are saying that is a real possibility, which is why I don't understand why we keep, we, I said we like, we have anything to do with it, but people like Elon Musk, um, why they keep creating more AI, but AI is everywhere. It's on your phone, it's on your ring doorbell, it's in your car and everywhere you, you look or you, you know, things that you have, it's AI. And so I wouldn't want one of those because yeah, it could, you know, take over. I tell you guys about my car all the time. I took it to the dealership. I thought my transmission was acting up. Thought maybe they need to keep it for some time to fix it. Came back in like 15 minutes to say, oh, we fixed it. They said it was the uh, transmission that's actually a computer. It was driving the way it wanted to drive. So we adjusted it so you can be in control. And I was like, hmm, I don't know about that, but it's just the way it is now. And so, uh, interesting that Tesla is now producing this robot, but scary because we can have a whole lot of those things running around eventually and we could be in trouble as humans. So y'all tell me what you think it is and would you spend $20,000 on a robot? And for more insightful commentary, please subscribe to this channel and my channel, The Demetri K Show, here on YouTube. Peace. Make sure you pick up my two books that's in Amazon right now. The first one, 
is past aggressive racism in the system of white supremacy. And I talk about in that particular book, how the system of white supremacy really runs and on our daily lives here in America. In our latest book, Seven Steps to Decolonize the Mind, we go through those steps to try to deprogram you uh, from the system of white supremacy. Make sure you can pick up those books on Amazon.com. Thank you.